I'm so cold. You see me now, I am just doubling riches. I'm not with any shit bitches. Trying to get up to my level, copy and paste type bitches. One in a million bitches. Alia would have me on her playlist, not playing games. Summer Walker type niggas. Cash, got it. Style, copped it. House, won it. Car, I ate. So what you say? Well, and here we are. Today is the last day of 2021. It's the very first time my family and I are spending a December in South Africa without any travel plans. Usually, um, I'm waiting. I'm waiting for the wind to subside because you won't be able to hear me because of the mic. Usually, for a December. We travel if we're gonna be in South Africa we'll go to like Cape Town or something and um, I don't know a lot has changed I think the pandemic has humbled a lot of us um, I'm currently four months pregnant 20 weeks um, I'm halfway through my pregnancy meaning in 20 weeks I'll see my child and I'm, I'm happy um, it's been a very difficult pregnancy. I think the beginning was exciting. I think I had fun during my first trimester and then second trimester of the pregnancy just became chaotic. Um, also, I had to keep like the beginning of this pregnancy a secret because I didn't know how my family was going to react. So a lot of things have been um, very lonely. Um, but we persevered like we, i feel like we've gone past that now when we're on social media and stuff it's like easy to oh uh i've never cried on camera i'm so sorry wait never cry on camera oh my gosh that's an actual tear i know when we're on social media it's like so easy to um portray how great life is but sometimes you take so many punches that um i mean 2021 career wise was fantastic i'm sure you see i had a tedx talk which i will put here as well oh my gosh now I like my makeup <laughs> i'm messing up my makeup my tedx talk which was amazing and i'll you can watch it here I did a lot of public speaking this year that pushed me to the limit and it's not like I did it on my own. I had my mentor by the side by my side, um, Ms. Charmaine, who really, really has helped me propel and soar um just in the space of a year. But um I think my personal life wow <laughs> my personal life this year, I went through a breakup a very chaotic and traumatic breakup and you know when you depart from a person that's when they show you how ugly they can be that's when they show you how they true character um had to 
break up and when we broke up it was so sad it was, I was I was very sad I think it still hurts me now I haven't spoken about this oh my gosh oh my gosh this is ridiculous if you watch season one of my lives in care you'll know how me and my boyfriend met um, my ex-boyfriend I still call him my boyfriend oh my gosh and um, we were together for two years and during those two years we were trying so hard to have a baby and then within that month that we broke up I got pregnant all right so my baby's room is almost done being set up we got the crib right here we got the crib um I think God knew that I was supposed to have a girl child because look at this new mat I got you guys So I got her some new toys. Okay, so that I bought probably at the beginning of my pregnancy. It was one of the first items that I bought for her. This is a gift from my mentor, Auntie Charmaine. So I'm done recording because now I'm messing up my makeup for the day. All of these tears. But 2021, thank you. I'm going to move on to the next chapter of my life. Um, I'm going to be an amazing mother, I hope. When my baby gets here, I just want them to know that mom did everything in their power to make sure that things were aligned. To make sure that they go to the best schools. To make sure that they live the most pain-free life um, I'm going to put everything into my child regardless of, of um, things that are chaotic around me I'll always protect them and shelter them from that um, this wind is really going to pick up this wind is going to pick up so bad in this video and I'm sorry guys for the bad sound I need to upgrade my equipment and my mics and everything but um last thing that I want to cover is that um, but that doesn't mean that you're not special it doesn't mean that you're not loved it doesn't mean that you're not meant to be and that's something that I will teach my little baby my little dread from having a girl or a boy because I only found out in January but I have a name and I only let you guys know that name in future so um yeah 2021 good fucking bye my nigga <laughs> I'm gonna edit that part out and mwah. This is the day I, I got pregnant. I thought I was going to be a housewife. I know that sounds really bizarre. I always thought I would have lots of kids, be getting up. It's also the day morning, I met my child's like father. Super early, coming home, you know, making breakfast for everyone, packing lunches, driving all the kids.